Welcome to this AVG tutorial on how to create a bootable AVG rescue disk on a USB flash drive. The first step is getting the source files for creating the rescue disk. You can download them free of charge from our web pages. Open your preferred web browser. In this example, we'll be using Internet Explorer. Click the address bar and type www.avg.com slash download and then press enter. Now click the AVG Rescue CD option in the left menu. As you can see, there are three files available for download. The first one is an ISO file for creating a bootable CD or DVD. If you want to have the AVG Rescue CD product on a CD, and not on a USB, as will be demonstrated in this video tutorial, just download this ISO file and burn it onto the CD. Just take care to burn it as bootable ISO and not as pure data. If you are not sure how to do this, refer to the manual of your burning software. The RAR and ZIP files are intended for the creation of a bootable flash disk. They both contain the same data, just packed using different archiving methods. Because you want to create a bootable flash disk, we'll download this archive. Specifically, the zip file, because Windows operating systems include built-in tools for operations with zip archives, so there will be no need to use any third-party archiving software to unpack it. So we'll click the zip archive and start the download process. In this dialog box, click Save. This will download the source zip file to your PC. Now you'll be asked where to save the file. In our example, we will leave the predefined location, the desktop. Clicking Save in this dialog starts the download. Please wait until the download is complete. This may take a few moments. After the file is downloaded, you can close this dialog and also the web browser window. Now it's time to extract the downloaded files. You can see that the archive is available on the desktop, so just double click it to see its content. To extract files, use the Extract All Files option. As a note for Windows XP users, in your environment this option should be located in the left menu. Here we can select the destination where the extracted files will be stored. In our example, we'll keep the desktop, so there is no need to change anything in this dialog. Just click Extract. Extraction is now in progress. After it's finished, a window with the extracted files is displayed. Now it's time to plug in a USB flash drive. Just take a USB flash drive where there is enough free space, approximately 320 megabytes is required, and insert it into the USB port. During the USB installation, no files already stored in the USB drive are deleted or modified, so you do not need to back anything up. When it is detected and installed, we can start with the bootable flash drive preparation. Launch the setup file from the folder where the extracted files are available. Confirm the launching of this file if you are asked by Windows Security Warning. Now we just have to select a letter from the drop-down menu that represents the removable drive we've just plugged in. In our case, it's the F drive. You can verify it in the computer disk tree. And after the proper drive is selected, just click Install. And wait until the process is finished. And that's all. You can now also close Windows Explorer. The AVG Rescue USB flash disk is now ready for use. You can boot the PC from this flash disk and use its capabilities for removing viruses that cannot be removed using standard methods. You can visit our web pages, download installation files and documentation, check our FAQs, or contact our 24-7 technical support anytime. Thank you for your attention.